The things that is important I want to cover in this video is the two down here, the chest and this totem, okay? As you can see right now, I'm right here and here is one totem. And sometimes they are here so you can catch them and another times, normally they used to be uh, hide up. By hide up, I mean like this place down up here some of them these totems was up uh, far up uh, how to tell you like this mountain it was up there and you cannot walk there and the way you do this sometimes if you are to the place and you see on the map oh it should be here but it's not here and it's something sometimes it's something over you it means you need to use the leather and by using the leather guys you go to the shop Oh, let's get back of here, go to the shop and down here you buy some of these leathers, okay? And you go back when you purchase one of them and you press on these settings and you go down there and hold, press on the leather and release it up there. And now if I face my uh, direction this way now and hold, press on the leather look the leather will spawn and now it's wrong way okay now i use another one this way look and now i can climb this way so the places you are stuck you cannot find them it means you need to do use the leather or sometimes you need to use this one to get really tiny small so you can go inside some small hole and enter to open them the same is for the chest and the totem okay so that is for totem and for the chest guys, I'm going to explain you some of them. The one that is here close to the butt that up here, if you teleport there. When you get here guys, to the boat, the boat inside there is a chest that requires a key. And the key, it says the little thief have the key. And the little thief is a little monster that spawns in here place, this area, and you kill him. And you get the key and go open it but some of the chest needs something different okay and here guys here in this place there is another chest okay and this chest you need to kill a mob here it used to spawn here it's a rabbit it's a white rabbit okay it used to spawn in this area when you kill him the chest will appear and you take the chest okay and is one more here very close to this place i cannot remember what that is but it will show us on your map okay that one when you get to that place you see a chest there but around the chest there is some root or what to call it some tree around the chest okay then what you need to do you go back here and you buy one of these fires okay and let's remove the mount and you go back here and you take the fire hold it and replace it and you face to your face direction to the chest and press on the fire and then you will throw the fire on the chest and the root from the chest will disappear and then you can open the box but some of the chest oh let's do this some of the chest is something red around it some big red okay then what you need you need something to explode this red to open the chest then you go to this action house and you go to the functional functional item and you see it says bump you buy one of these and you throw this on the chest the same way you go back here and you pick it up and you throw it on the chest okay and then it will explode and then you can open the chest so you have all of this you need here for a chest here okay if not here sometimes it requires you to go to the action house and buy from here okay and sometimes they require chest uh, key sorry when it's required you to buy key then sometimes you have to go to check this totem places some of them drop you key so when you start to unlocking places, the chests will appear. And when you do you see all of these things down here, you will get more and more reward. Okay. 
So start doing this early so it don't get too much. And there is one more chest, guys, in this place I found. To this place, okay? In there is one more chest. It requires you nothing. So this is for a chest and the totem. The rest is really easy, guys. The picture is sometimes difficult to find, but I'm not focusing right now on the picture because the chest does give good rewards. The chest does give you silver, gems, incredible stones. So I'm right now focusing just on the chest. And there is one more also in this place, I think, in this um, diving cable, what the name is. There, what you need to do, you need to activate all the three lines. Let me show you. Look here, guys. You see, here is one of these. You can activate. Let me mark this for you. It's one here. Okay. And as you can see, it is one here and one up there. Can you see it? And one up there. You activate this three and you go down and there is one more. You activate this down there and you can open the chest. So there is one of them. So that was for chest and quest guys. So if anything you need, you just go here when you stack on chest and open them and use one of these, okay? And buy here or you buy from the store. So I hope this was helpful guys. And if you want me to guide you through the next chest I'm gonna do, let me know so I do, uh, so I record the videos when I do the chests so you can see how I'm doing this. If you're interested in doing this chest, I will recommend you to do that guys, because they give you good reward. And this way you can boost yourself with incredible stones, silver and so on and gems. So if you want me to make videos about that, let me know and have a nice day. If I forgot anything, I apologize for that. Let me know if I missed anything. Have a nice day. See you all. Bye.